during three weeks of pretrial hearings, Theodore Robert Bundy argued for a delay in his forthcoming trial. Charged last July with murdering three FSU co-eds, Bundy has filed dozens of motions. Judge Edward Coward has denied motions that the trial be delayed, moved, closed to the press and television, and he is now considering a motion that Bundy be given a new attorney. Bundy and public defenders assigned to the case want to part company. Bundy's choice is this man, Millard Farmer. Farmer has a reputation of being disruptive, and he's been denied the right to defend Bundy. The trial is set to begin on Monday, and it's shaping up to be one of the most celebrated trials in recent years. Well over 200 reporters have been issued credentials to cover the proceedings. With the TV camera allowed in the courtroom again, crews from Salt Lake City, Denver, Seattle, and all three national news networks have come to Tallahassee. Cables from the courtroom to the eighth floor of the bank building next door will feed live video to a maze of video recorders that were being set up Friday. A stack of folding chairs and tables have been brought in for use by the media, and the phone company is busy installing a dozen phones for use by the TV crews. Most people in Tallahassee believe that Bundy is guilty of the crimes he's been charged with, and they're glad the trial is about to start. But on Monday, Theodore Robert Bundy will have his chance to prove innocence.